Cheyenne Tooling and Manufacturing is the company behind the Sunmaster header. Here's farmer and company owner Jim Broughton. As you know, I brought up on a farm, farmed all my life. It's customer service, customer loyalty. That's what you try to build. And if you take care of your customer, you're in pretty darn good shape. Here's Cheyenne Manufacturing's Brandy Edland. We had a guy in South Dakota that called. Uh, he was concerned with loss on his uh, some of his sunflower ground. He was curious what we could do for him. We set him up with a Sunmaster header, telling him we could probably yield 6 to 10% higher. It didn't take him long. He called me back and said, we were probably averaging closer to 20 and 25% higher. I wouldn't say that's, uh, that's an overall average, but for that one individual, that's what he was seeing out of it. It was a no-brainer, and he ordered another one. Sunmaster header owner Mitchell Bauman. We have two 12 row Sunmasters. We run them for Milo and Sunflowers. So it's kind of got a dual purpose head there. And it works great for Milo because we can leave a lot of that residue standing out there. So instead of just using our draper headers, we can use them Sunmaster to stand that plant up and just bring the head into the machine. So it works great. Sunflower and grain sorghum farmer Marvin Kaus. What I liked about them was just that the, uh, the knife placement on them. With the Milo, you know, with your knife clear at the back, you can be getting your crop divider clear on the ground up front and you'll still leave 10 12 inches of stubble that's that's a really neat bonus we had uh, a large custom harvester contact us inquiring about the sun master um, spent some time with them uh, at his farm here at the factory and he he went ahead and ordered a couple headers uh, we delivered those down there got into the got into the fields uh, right away the first day made some adjustments got everything dialed in and uh, the owner immediately come out and did a couple of rounds And within an hour, he ended up ordering another. If we had one downside, it was the clutches. So we did the active clutch technology, which increases clutch strength by up to 30%. Going forward, we're making uh, guide and snout changes to to improve in the sorghum country uh, to try and get more of that down crop. Cosmetically, we tried to make it so it could look good on every combine out there. It doesn't matter what color or what manufacturer it is. It's just a machine that uh, just known for the job it does. We have... uh, People that use custom cutters that they're demanding, they have our headers on their machines. You know, all depends on conditions, but I haven't lost a sales pitch yet where I said, if you give me per acre what you save, that's the cost of the rental of using that head. And I haven't lost yet. Someday I will, but I haven't lost that bet yet. So it's been, it's been very good for us, and, and our reputation is carried on that.